The last video of this lesson deals with the Fraction Splat series, developed by Steve Aborny. And what you see here are three circles, and then there are four quarter circles, or four circles where one quarter is shaded. And the idea is, what number does this represent? So, what is the shaded part? And what I have here, I have three whole circles, and then four quarters. Three and four fourths comes out to be four. So, four. It, so this whole this shape here, all these shades, the shaded part represents four. Now, splat. Imagine part of it is covered up. The question is, what is the total underneath the splat? And there's a number of ways you can go about it. But what it really amounts to is that I, uh, you the whole thing is four. And what it's showing is 2 and 1 fourth. So this is essentially the missing add-in model of subtraction, where we know one number, you know, like the 2 and 1 fourth plus what is equal to 4. And so the answer, I would need 3 fourths in order to make it a whole number. 2 and 1 fourth plus 3 fourths is 3, and I would need one more. So I know this comes out to be 1 and 3 fourths. And if I uncheck, um, uncover that splat, you can see that there's one whole circle and three quarters that were shaded, that were covered up by the splat. All right, so what number is here? I have four whole circles and then three thirds. So four and three thirds is five. Splat. Now, what number is underneath the splat? Well, as a subtraction problem, this is essentially going to be 5 minus 2 and 1 third. So in order to subtract, I would, uh, I mean, you can do this uh, by the mix, subtracting mixed numbers, or you can think of it at, that I have 1 third, I would need 2 thirds more in order to get a whole. 2 and a third and 2 thirds is 3. From there, I would need two more. So I know that what's underneath this splat has got to be two and two thirds. If I check, that's exactly what's underneath the splat. Okay, try another one. Let's say the whole thing, we know the whole thing is six, but some part of it is already covered up. So what has been covered up? So again, this comes out to be six. And what is uncovered is the two and a half. So in terms of mixed numbers, you can treat this as six minus two and then zero minus one half. Six minus two is four and then minus one half gives me three and a half. So there should be three and a half underneath that splat. If I check it, I see there is one, two, and then two halves, three and a half. So it does check. One last one. So the whole, um, the whole shaded part comes out to be four, but one and three fourths is shown. So what is left over? Well, I know that four minus one is three, and then 0 minus 3 fourths is negative 3 fourths. So now 3 minus 3 fourths, it would be 2 and 1 fourth. So there are 3 fourths there. I would need one more quarter to make a hole. So one hole plus the hole that's showing is 2, and I would need 2 more to get the 4. Have I uncheck? There is one hole right there, and then there are four quarters there, and one quarter left over. So two and one quarter does check.